Hey there guys, my name is Vlad and welcome to my channel. So if you are new here, please consider subscribing if you like the content. Today I got something interesting for you, I wanted to test and show you guys how much does RAM speed affect FPS in games. So I did an extensive testing which took quite a lot of my time but the results are pretty interesting and they might help you choose the correct RAM for your next or current build. This video would not be possible without Crucial memory, so big thanks to Crucial for sending this 32GB kit. And this is their Ballistics 3200MHz kit featuring two sticks of 16GB which is actually better than I expected to be as it has amazing overclock potential. These kits are also available in red and black colors and of course RGB and the white one as you can see here. In their lineup they also have Ballistics Max memories which goes up to 4400MHz and are one of the best kits on the market today. One great thing that I like about Crucial as a company is that they are owned by Micron and as you may or may not know, Micron is one of the largest manufacturers of memory chips. Many graphics cards and also other RAM kits on the market have their chips inside, so for their own lineup they pick only the best ones. With all that said, here is the test setup I will be using for these tests. Ryzen 9 3900X CPU, MSI X570 Tomahawk Wi-Fi board and MSI Gaming X3O RTX 2080 Ti GPU. All tests were done in 1080p and 1440p as I did not want to do any in 4K. To be honest, percentage of people playing in 4K according to latest Steam survey is exactly 2%, with 1440p on the constant rise. So to 2% of you out there, sorry guys to disappoint you this time. Most common resolution is still 1080p and this is the resolution you would see the most benefit of faster RAM speeds. As we go higher to 1440p, that difference is not that big. And on 4K it's literally in the margin of error territory, so there you are not completely left out, because in this case, I mean if you are gaming at 4K resolution, go with 3200MHz kit. So without further ado, here are the results in several popular games and also in some synthetic benchmarks, just so you can see would you benefit here as well. So as you can see, if you're gaming at 1080p, best price to performance option would be to get the 3200MHz CL16 kit. 
and if you want to squeeze some more performance, go with 3600MHz kit. But only if the price is not that greater than 3200MHz kit, as the benefit might not be worth that much. It's worth mentioning that this particular 3200MHz kit hit 3600MHz on the same timings as 3200MHz and same voltage without breaking a sweat. So crucial, heads down for making a great memory kit with amazing OC potential. I did hit 3800MHz with raising the voltage a bit more, but it yields diminishing returns. More power needed, more heat generated for a difference which is less than 5%, so in my opinion not worth it. But as I said, 3200MHz remains the sweet spot for Ryzen systems regardless of which resolution you are gaming. And Crucial is offering great OC potential as well. So there you have it, use this knowledge wisely. Subscribe to the channel if you find this video useful, like and share and do let me know in the comments what you think of it if you have any questions or suggestions. I'll be seeing you in the next one.